Hello everybody, Over Easy Evan here. Um, this is episode 5 of the Banish Let's Play playthrough. It's early spring in Egg Cartington. You can see we've already got things going here. Just trying to get <laughs> prepared for the next winter. Um, it's basically what you do in this game is just make sure you're prepared for winter. And as you can see in the event log here, we're running low on food, running low on stone. It's kind of where we left off last episode. Um, we were building up this stone house and we're actually very close to completing that here. Um, we did have a, oh boy, what, what is that called? We had a trading post that we were thinking about building. Um, before I started filming this episode, I decided to get rid of that. Um, I've been watching some videos and it made me think trading post might not be the best idea just yet. As you can see, we're running low on food again. I think, well, we have two extra builders here we don't need. So what I'm going to do is add extra hunter, extra fisherman. Um, we will be getting a lot more food in, ter in uh, terms of crops. Now, oh shoot, I did not mean to do that. Oh no. Uh, I don't know if there's a way to like undo that. Unharvest, please. Uh, whoops. <laughs> Hopefully that doesn't harvest it. But I'm not sure it's going to go well growing wheat over the top of wheat from last year. And I know that can be an issue. So we have no other options right now to grow crops. So hopefully we can figure that out. Um, one thing we could do is grow a gatherer's hut. And that might allow us, um, that might allow us to get more crops. I don't really know, but let's just try it out. Why not? I think putting it over here is smart. Maybe, maybe back here. I think here is actually okay because we're still getting all this. Not really missing out on anything, and then it's right next to this other building. Um. Okay, so we've got this going. Now we could actually use the extra builders. Funny how that works. Um. Okay, let's drop one of the fishermen off. Do three builders. We'll let it run. So we're low on food. We're low on stone. I know we have people working on the stone, so we should be okay there. But I'm going to make sure we're still getting more. Um, did they end up harvesting? It looks like they are harvesting. That's too bad. It just I just don't know a way around it. If anybody does play this game and knows how you... Oh, no, hold on. The yield's going up. I don't know. I'm confused on how that works. So if anybody... Yeah, if anybody plays this game that knows how that works, please feel free to let me know because I'm just... I'm just unsure. Um, we're holding off on wood cutting right now. We have quite a bit of firewood. So we're fine there. Yeah, it looks like we're just low on food. Maybe we needed more crops. But I'm thinking the fish we're bringing in should be pretty good. And the venison we're bringing in, or meat in general, should be pretty good. Um, we have this herbalist here we're not actually currently uh, running. And we have our gatherer's hut. I, I don't know what the gatherer's hut's going to do. I've actually never built one, so we'll have to see. So I'm going to speed it up, actually, to five times speed here. Just because we're kind of waiting... Kind of just waiting. Get some more stone over there. Keep an eye on our food. Okay. Okay, we've got some coming in now. And that's the thing, we, we don't really need the herbalist heart right now. We have extra herbs with nothing to do with them. Ooh, one thing I wanted to build potentially was a tailor. Are we, I mean, it's late spring. Are we gonna get more than uh are we going to get more than eight people that need coats? I don't really know. And I don't think so. Um, it's an interesting thought, though. Sorry about that. Just <laughs> let my dog out of the room. She's trying to break free. Um, I'm going to hit play again. And let's see. Yeah, they so they did harvest all this. Really got no wheat. That's just, that's just too bad. 
Yeah, I don't really know what to do about that. At least this one, you, I, we might be in big trouble here with food, though, because of that. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Is anybody building this? Yeah, they are building that. Which is good. Um, I'm not quite sure what to do in terms of food. I mean, it just feels like we're falling behind. An orchard, perhaps? Where would be a good spot? Over here? Why is 15 by 3 okay, but 16 by 3 and 17 by 3 is too small? Does that make any sense to anyone? Too small. Wait, what? I'm really confused here. Oh, I bet you you just can't make it that narrow. Let's just try that and see what happens. Pecans! Look at that. Okay, cool. We have the ability to add someone to the gatherer's hut. Let's go ahead and do that. Um, We don't need builders anymore. Well, let's have somebody... Oops. Do we not have anyone that can do this? I'm just going to hit pause quick. Orchard. Um, oh, it just must be farmers, huh? Yeah, we're going to have to bump up to a third farmer, I think. Wait, I'm confused. Oh, okay. It automatically put the third farmer in here because we allowed them to have two there. But if we do that, do that, now someone's working there. Okay, that's kind of interesting how that works. So that's a reason why you would set how many you want. Like, you're not just going to let ten people work here. You only want one on... If you only... I mean, maybe you want more, but if you only want one on each um, little section here, you would just set it to one. And when you add a new farmer, it'll automatically, it won't go to these. It'll go to the one where you have an empty spot. So that's here. Uh, I'm really interested in how this is going to work. I almost want to set another gather here. We did get another adult, so we gain another laborer, which is always nice. It might be a good idea for us to build a school. And we don't need too much other than wood. Um, I want to make sure we are constantly, though, removing resources here. I I want to make sure there's not lazy laborers. <laughs> um, a child named Yanni. Gianni? Yanni or Gianni? I'm a Bucks fan, so I'm going to say Yanni. Like Giannis. <laughs> um, but that's all, also nice. We have eight children now. Which is why I'm thinking about getting a school built. Why not? What's the worst that could happen? Let's build a school. It's late summer. I don't know if we'll get it built before winter. Um, which I don't necessarily want to be building things through winter, but if we have to, we have to. You can see over here we got our orchard going. Um, Albert's got well, Albert has fish I'm guessing the fish aren't from the orchard but what do I know uh, <laughs> if you look at the storage barn here we have berries we have onions we have a th yeah we have mushrooms too so that's actually pretty good and it's a, a good wide range of food whoa Reming became an adult we now have five laborers and a child named Howley was born, which is very nice. We've got a lot of wheat coming in here. Oh my lord, we have a lot of venison as well. 300 fish. This is looking good. Uh, we kind of somewhat disregarded building in this season. We have hardly built much at all. Uh, you can see here people did move into the stone house, which is great. But we didn't build too much. I am just very concerned about 
food and firewood and clothing. Uh, I don't... Six hide coats. Okay, so building a tailor is going to be basically a main priority, I would say, for next season. It's probably too late now. Oh, we have no builders. Let's get some builders. Do we need three farmers? No. We're going to live with two farmers. This field's done. They actually did get another yield out of this one, which is kind of crazy. Maybe because we... Um, Maybe because we harvested this one so early, but 494 wheat, 389 venison, 311 fish seems good. I... Okay, they don't have a ton of food. Everybody seems to have a decent amount of food. And some firewood. It is autumn. Uh, we have not very much in terms of logs. I'm going to pause quick just to make sure I can get this going. Let's harvest some trees. Let us get you going, Mr. Woodcutter, or Mrs. Woodcutter. Who knows? You know what? We know. Lynette, Mrs. Woodcutter. I apologize. Um, we have, oh wow, two children born. Since I've last checked 10 seconds ago. Uh, Lily and Elf born. So now we're up to 26 people in this village. 26 people in six houses is probably okay. Uh, we're gonna want to build another one, though. Definitely. And I'm not sure how I want to do this. I think what I want to do... Reserve of logs is all yet, but we, we set up to cut some more, so we're fine. And there's the snow. I'm gonna pause quick. S slow it down, actually. I'm going to extend this road out to here. And then build some houses over here. These are going to be stone houses. I'm gonna build three more there. And I kind of wish this well was moved now that I'm seeing it here. It's fine, no, it's not a big deal. People are gonna have to move these. Oh, there's only two or four, so it's not too bad. You can probably stop. You can stop. Um, let's, ooh. let's bump up the builders. I wanna keep some laborers. I don't know how much gathering is gonna work in winter. I don't know if it will at all. I'm gonna turn it off. We still have three fishermen, which you can fish during winter. We have three hunters. That should be plenty of food. Firewood wise, we're doing great actually. Might need to even stop soon. Chill on the firewood, maybe. Let's do that. Maybe it's a mistake, but I don't know. Um, I think I'm gonna run a little bit longer in this episode. I've been doing them around maybe 12 minutes or so up to like 15, but I think I don't want to end up this series having like 70 episodes, so I'm probably going to do more in like the 15 to 20 minute range, if that, I think that makes sense. Um, I don't like episodes in Let's Play series when it's like a 70, 60, 50 minute video. That's just too long. And if you do like 10 minute videos, then you end up having hundreds of videos, and that's also kind of annoying. Um, so I think I'm going to aim for around 15 to 20 instead. Hopefully that works out for everyone else as well. Our reserve of logs is still low, but the reason being we're chopping firewood. Actually, that is really the only reason, and now we're done with that. So let us make sure we're getting more firewood, or sorry, logs. Should be fine there. I don't know why there's logs just sitting out here. What's that all about, guys? Okay, now we got some logs coming in. Food, oh wow, we have a lot of food. A lot of food in the storage barn still. Plenty. This is excellent. I would, always happy to see a surplus of food. I really don't care if it, if there's a surplus. Oh, that's where our logs went. I forgot about the schoolhouse. 
You know, I don't even know if we're going to be able to use this schoolhouse effectively, but we'll do our best. We'll, we'll see what happens. I'm going to add a fifth builder. We have five laborers, which is pretty good. Yeah, man, the micromanaging this, the professions is going to get tough once we actually have things like a teacher, physician, a tailor. Um, and then in, in the fall, spring, and summer, we're going to have to deal with the herbalist gatherers, things like that, farmers. So it's going to get tough. But, you know, we have right now we have 16 able-bodied adults that are able to do it. So hopefully they can handle it. I don't know. We have a child, Ibrahim, born. I'm going to speed this up to five times again so we can get through a little bit more. I, I noticed that we went through maybe three or four episodes, almost an hour worth and it was only one year and if we want to get through more of this I'm gonna have to run it five times at least I think a little bit more than usual it doesn't always have to be five times speed but maybe even ten times speed if we're just waiting on stuff um, I don't think I'll do much ten times speed I think that's probably too fast can you do you can I think five times is safe for now maybe later on I'll do ten times we'll see so here's our schoolhouse uh, we have zero students, we have zero teachers. That's the reason, I would assume. I'm going to bump it up to one and see what happens. But I also want to look. Probably should have done this before I built it, huh? Used to educate citizens to become more productive. That seems good to me. That seems useful using one teacher for that. So I'm going to keep an eye on this and see if we actually have students. Right now we have zero students. I'm really hoping that doesn't stay zero because then we're just straight up wasting someone here. Our log's running low. I mean, 24, 24, 24. That would be why here for our stone houses. I didn't think you had to use 24 logs for stone houses. That's a lot. That's okay, though. It's okay. Keep harvesting some of these trees that are nearby. It's going to become an issue later. Uh, pretty soon here, I might even build a forest or lodge. Uh, maybe I even do that. Uh, maybe after winter, I'll do that. We've got Michael, Michael, Michael becoming an adult, up to 17 workers. Oh boy, low on stones now. Oh, that makes sense. The stone houses. Yep, yep, yep. Well, now we're in late winter. Oh wow, we have no stored logs, no stored stone. How's food? We're burning through the wheat pretty quick. We're up, we still have 300 venison, 52 fish, and everybody has stuff in their homes. So I'm feeling pretty good. Feeling pretty good about that. I, I wish we had the opportunity to grow more than wheat. I really do. I'm not sure how you do that. I might have to look into that. Into what we need to do for that um, outside of playing on here. But we'll see. Sword food 360, stored firewood 250, which is fine. Oh, whoops, looks like we lost our thing here. And I'm gonna pause there. This is actually probably a great time to stop <laughs> with our reserve of food low, but we've made it to year three. Everybody's relatively health healthy. We have four and a half star average health, which is nice. We've made it. I think that was a full year in an episode, wasn't it? Five times speed does wonders. But we've made it to year three. We have 27 people in egg carton to now, which is not bad. 17 fully able-bodied adults, able to work for us. We have got um, three new stone houses built, which is really nice. People aren't as cramped. For 27 people having one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight houses and a ninth coming, that's pretty good. We've got our schoolhouse built. We have got our gatherers hut built, and we're we're doing we're doing good here. I think we're doing good here. We, oh, we have our orchard built as well. So, for the next episode, I think what we're gonna do is try to get a tailor built because we're very low on coats. Um, maybe expand this even further to get some more houses built. We'll see on that, and we'll see what to do from there as well, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Um, if you are interested in catching me live ever and you have not watched me on Twitch, I am live on Twitch. I don't have a set schedule as of now, 
But if you follow me on Twitch, you can see when I go live and get notifications. So if you are interested in more of an interactive format, check me out on Twitch, twitch.tv slash over easy oven. Otherwise, guys, I will see you next time in the next episode. Thank you so much for watching. Bye for now.